वेलकम बैक माई ऑसम फ्रेंड्स ऑल ऑफ माई व्यूअर्स टूडे इज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन वॉट इज इमोरल टू यू ए पर्सन और ए बिहेवियर ऑफ ए पर्सन दैट कॉन्सियसली गोज एगेंस्ट दी एक्सेप्टेड नॉर्म ऑफ द सोसाइटी दैट इज कॉल्ड इमोरलिटी at this juncture we need to be very much clear about it what is immoral and what is amoral immoral things are that already i described that it is beyond the acceptable norm of the society but amoral is when a person doesn't understand what to do just like an animal animal doesn't have the power to distinguish so what is bad and what is good we may describe that situation as a amoral but it is not immoral and another conception is also required all the immoralities are not crime and maybe all the crimes are not also immorality there are also certain things which are overlapped between between these two crime and immoral those things really deplorable maybe those things are murder robbery or sometimes debauchery okay many other things sometimes rioting all these things are immoral and there are many simple things i can tell you the obesity of those simple things immoral apathy betrayal cheating depriving all these things are immoral things when i see a person is shivering in the morning hour of the winter season when i go to the morning walk that time i also feel myself that i am also indulging some immoralities because as a part of the society i could have done something for that poor people and when i see some young boy out of hunger they steal some food from this nearby shop and shopkeeper caught him and <coughs> beat him tremendously mercilessly so that is also one sort of immorality in the feelings many garage we used to see a lot of young people who are helping the mechanic and usually those young people are named as a tenia common name everywhere in india and these are those people are just just doing to help their family to earn something extra money out of compulsion but as a citizen of this country i think immoral to myself because country couldn't provide them the free education or couldn't provide them the condition of getting free education the situation was such there are some instances when i see that a stray dog got punished by the shopkeeper by being thrown hot water what was the crime of the stray dog because the stray dog tried to steal some food item out of the hunger so i can say in that case as the stray dog cannot understand what is good and what is bad the animal are generally driven by their instant instinct and because of hunger that poor creature tried to steal something but in response out of anger what the shopkeeper has done by throwing the hot water it is immoral 
many things in the society it is happening atrocities to the hapless people unfortunate people and depriving the poor and the downtrodden all are these cases of immorality may not be the crime every time but definitely those are immorality at our personal level we must do whatever we can do for example if we are able to buy some books for the poor children who are studying in the school we should do or if we can contribute by giving them some dresses we should do in such way with some small small activity activities by all the people of the society we can at least soothe their pain at least minimize their pain we cannot eradicate everything by our single effort but at least something is better than nothing we should contribute to the society as per our capacity and our mentality should be driven on such a way that we must not harm to anybody unnecessarily we must try to help as a good citizen as a good person of the society and you know when you serve more you can deserve more because whatever you are contributing there is a multiplication law it might return to you in a multiplied way as a benefit of you so out of that thinking also we should be encouraged to help the society to help to reduce the immoralities in the society my dear awesome friends stay awesome stay productive bye